Hello! So before I show you how this works, all the links are in the description. So if you have any trouble, uh, just write a comment or join the Discord server and I'm gonna help you. Anyways, let me show you how this works. So the first thing you're gonna do is download the zip file, which is going to be in the description. And you should see something like this. Now you can't just run it, you have to extract these files. So I'm just going to do it on my desktop, just create a new folder, name it whatever you want, and I'm going to move all the files into the folder. But uh, before we run anything, let me show you what happens when I open Task Manager. Right, we can see all the processes, and if I open Notepad, you can see that it shows up. I open Paint, for example, it shows up right here. So this is exactly what Spoofer allows us to do, is to hide as many processes as we want. And the way we do that is by going into the app data. So press Windows key plus R, go percent sign, update percent sign. And in here, we're going to create a new text file and name it hide.txt. For you, the .txt might not show up because I have view file name extensions enabled. You can enable it if you want, just make sure it's a text file. So let's just edit the file. And I'm gonna add notepad.exe, mspain.exe. You can save this, so control S to save it. And then let's launch the spoofer. So you just right click and then run as administrator. Once you do that, you should see something like this. Now, by default, uh, Spoofer is hidden from Task Manager. So if I was to open Notepad, for example, you can see it's not showing up. If I was to open Paint, you can see that it's not showing up. And that's basically how it works. So in case you can't run this, this is a C++ program, so you're gonna need the x64 bit version. So just go on Google and go Visual C++ and download the 64 version of the C++. Just click it, download it, install it, and it should work just fine. Anyways, you can find all the info in the description. Join the server, and if you have any questions, just ask them if you need any updates, if you want updates, let me know and I'll make sure to add them. Thank you for watching and bye.